Hey guys, got a minute? It is Stephanie again. Um, and I wanted to follow up on some things that Clay's been talking about this week. He was talking about how different objects react differently when put in hot water um, in those moments of challenge and how as Christians, like we can be like that coffee and really in these moments of stress or challenge, um, instead of being changed, we can still be changing our environment and making it stronger and making ourselves stronger. And that really spoke to me this morning. Um, as you know, we've talked about, or I've talked about, I mean, we're in a season of pushing, of, um, of grinding. Sometimes you're just in a season where you know that there's a hard, we're in, we're in the uphill right now. And in my life personally, there are a lot of things that are really uncertain and something came out of left field yesterday that really kind of knocked me on my butt and I was like lord one more thing at this point I'm literally just putting one foot in front of the other stubbornly because these are the things you've called me to do so I'm going to continue to do them um and I feel like listening to Clay's message today about being the coffee you know there's a difference between dragging myself across this finish line And running this race with endurance, which is what scripture tells us to do, right? And it tells us not to lean on our own understanding. And I feel like the Lord just put those things in my spirit today and held me to realize that in those seasons of push, in those seasons of, I don't really see the light at the end of the tunnel, but I know it's there and I know I'm on the path you've called me to and I'm just going I don't have, we don't have to be miserable. We don't have to be fearful. We don't have to be, woe is me, like this is so hard. Because you know what? We don't draw from our own strength. That's what it means to me to to run this race with endurance. To say, wow, the world might look at my circumstances right now and be like, I don't know how you're still standing. I don't know how you're still smiling. But the fact is I can still be doing those things. I can still be in my environments, be at my job, be in my family, be in my community and be a light. Even though I have a lot of um, uncertainty, I'm not going to call it fear. um, And the world might expect me to be fearful and anxious. No, I am going to still influence my environment. Um, So I wanted to leave that with you today. Maybe you're in a season of pushing, maybe you're not, but at some point in our lives, we will all be in that space. And so run your race well and lean on the Lord's understanding because he's the one that gives you the strength and the joy and the peace to get through it all. Thanks for taking a minute.